Well, so far, this is not a World Bowl that they will preserve in a time capsule for the football historians to study. <laughs> Barcelona's ball, first and ten, own 21-yard line against the favored London Monarchs. Interesting that back in Las Vegas, they were favored by 13 and a half. He came over here to London, and they were favored by only nine and a half. Barcelona, a winner the last time they played, the only team to beat London this year. Barcelona hopes that the defense can get the job done here today and that this offense with Jim Bell carrying the ball can get a couple of opportunity touchdowns. Defensively, this is a very talented group representing London. Mike Renner, Roy Hart, John Shannon in the line and sensational linebacking core led by Danny Lockett, featuring Marlon Brown, Ricky Williams, and Virgil Robertson. And the secondary is very good too. Irvin Smith, Dan Crossman, Dedrick Dodge, and Horace Irvin. They tried to pick on Irvin early and didn't get the job done. Bump and run from the corners right now. They back off a little bit. Bell bounces back to the outside for the first down. Out to the 40-yard line before Dodge tackles him. Jimmy Bell did a real good job. They were in a bare defensive front, the Buddy Ryan defense, and he had tried to attack up inside. It was nothing there. Hart stuffed it. See him stuff it right in the middle. He bounces now outside. And this is not typical of Bell's running. He's more of a slasher, but he did see the vision to the outside. Made a good run. Ernie and Bell made a little adjustment in practice this week. They have Bell just a little bit closer to the line of scrimmage than he was in that earlier meeting. Figuring that the daylight was there. If he hit it just a little bit quicker, he might get something. Into the middle, they run right at Roy Hart that time, and they didn't get too much. John Shannon helping out defensively. Take a look at the nose guard position, Roy Hart, the all pro. Here he is. He's a real quick guy, and they jump him around a lot, but they said in this game today they weren't going to jump him around very much and let him play head up, and Brandon actually on that play did a pretty good job. He is more dangerous when he jumps quickly around the center. Davis, a stand-up tight end, and he slips out as a receiver this time. They wanted Edgerton, a good play by Irvin that time. Horace Irvin knocked the ball free with that tackle. He used, smelled that one coming. See, they play, they throw that pass so many times that you can almost anticipate it. It's a quick hitch, and you can drive it. Many receivers will turn that quick hitch into a fade and go deep down the sideline when they read that tight coverage. Barcelona does not do that. And as a result, Irvin is able to cheat a yard or two, not expecting that play. Wilson checks in as the nickel back in that secondary. Ernie has misfired on his first two passes. Oh, a man's wide open! by the Monarchs. Derek Dodge. Brent, Barcelona took that play from the New York, New Jersey Knights. Mouse Davis play that uh, was two big plays against London last week. It's an out and up by the inside receiver, and they blew the coverage last week, if you'll remember. This week, they did not blow the coverage, get the interception. Oh, Gene Taylor was wide open on that far sideline. That was not a well-thrown pass. We'll come right back. The excitement of the Pan Am Games begins August 3rd on ABC Sports. <laughs> 